Video number 12. Shocking CPA marketing case studies from online marketers. Viperchill.com. Viperchill is a marketing blog containing strategies, tips, and informative posts. Blog topics include SEO tools, niche sites, backlinks, and other information to help businesses and marketers succeed. Viperchill's author decided to experiment with CPA and PPC after discovering that some of his friends were making tons of money with this marketing strategy. The first thing he did was join a forum called Called stackthatmoney.com. This way, he could ask questions and learn more quickly. Viperchill decided to use Google AdWords and Facebook for his CPA campaigns. However, he ended up going almost exclusively with Facebook, as Facebook only took 15 minutes to approve his ads, while Google took closer to 15 hours. After doing some research and using the tools available on Facebook, the first experiment yielded a return of nearly 25 times his spending. ZachJohnson.com Zach got started in internet marketing in the late 1990s. His first program, the Pacific Coast Feather Company Banner Click Program, was not very successful, but it proved to be a great learning tool. Then he began working with Amazon.com, and he began making money. He's been blogging since 2007, and his success has exploded. Recently, he discovered a dating site that targets men who play golf. He decided to create a CPA campaign to try to make money advertising the site, golfmates.com. Using great images and an attention-grabbing headline, he tested several Facebook ads. In addition, he used demographics to target the 300,000-plus men on Facebook who are single and play golf. In only a few days, he was able to generate a 253% ROI using this CPA campaign. HowToWebmaster.com HowToWebmaster offers marketing tips, how-tos, and blog posts, including topics such as marketing strategies, CPA strategies, and other useful information. The site owner recently launched a CPA campaign using payday loans as his niche. He chose this niche because the payday loan business offers high payouts just for having someone complete a form online. How to Webmaster chose the Everyday Payday one-page form submit from the Max Bounty CPA Network. After researching keywords and doing some ad testing to generate conversions, he tracked his progress for 30 days in December of 2013. By the end of that month, he saw an ROI of over 300%. Xsneaker.com. The author of Xsneaker.com, who provides information concerning IM tools as well as where to find discounts, decided to create a CPA campaign through Max Bounty. He is relatively new to the internet marketing game. After selecting Max Bounty as his network, he decided to use gaming as his vertical. After testing both landing pages and direct linking, he chose to go with direct linking for his campaign. He created ads for gaming sites and specific games. After the first 30 days, he had made nearly $1,000 in revenue. Once he scaled up and optimized his campaign, he made over $3,999 in revenue. His total profits for those 60 days was $2,455. HowToWebmaster.com In this case study, the author explains how he successfully created and launched a CPA campaign using an ROV trial offer from Peerfly CPA Network. He used Lead Impact as his PPV traffic source for his CPA campaign. In December of 2013, the author at HowToWebmaster.com saw an ROI of over 320%. He completed this case study to confirm that a credit card submit CPA campaign can be successful, and he was successful in turning a profit with only a few hours' work. IvanOng.com On his Mesa rating blog, IvanOng, Ivan spoke with one of his followers, William, who's a student. After learning from Ivan, this student earned $25,000 net profit in his third month doing CPA marketing. William had been doing internet marketing for about seven years, but he wanted to learn about CPA marketing as well. He launches five to ten campaigns per day using his networks. Each day he does optimization and uses lead impact. He found great success in continually adding campaigns and keeping them going and optimized. Using this strategy with CPA marketing, his ROI is 147%. IvanOng.com Stephen Teo Stephen Teo is a relatively new internet marketer. He began in June of 2013. In September of 2013, he was seeing a 345% ROI and a profit of over $5,000. He also creates numerous campaigns and continually tests them to make sure they're in top shape. Once his campaigns are successful and running well, he just keeps them running and watches his profits rise as he creates new campaigns. Presently, Stephen makes five figures per month, and this typically equals around $20,000 a month. StreamSEO.com 
Servando Silva of Stream SEO shares some of his success on his blog. In this case, he achieved great ROI with his Teespring t-shirts campaign. Servando did two things in this campaign. He set up a fan page and helped it grow by buying Facebook ads for likes. He also created Facebook ads for website clicks and conversions. For his fan page, he built a few fan pages based on some well-loved television characters and shows. Once his likes grew to two to five thousand, he created a t-shirt design and published it on Teespring. He launched the campaign and added some text. In addition, he promoted Teespring shirts in the Facebook news feed. Overall, he had an ROI of close to 200% and made $1,200.